Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars. This is the 1075% uh, difficulty uh, game. And uh, yeah, we're, uh, well we finished with the mystery, and that's, uh, well let's get the time rolling here. We finished with the uh, mystery, uh, so now we're just down to uh, uh, getting uh, the industrial base up so we can actually terraform everything to the point where we can open the domes, as I've uh, determined that opening the domes is uh, the uh, point at which uh, we will declare the game done, because after that it's just a bunch of tedious busy work, right? So, uh, what's this uh, want? Um, it's just ready to go somewhere, so okay. And this is uh, launching a high-speed comm satellite, right, okay. Uh, now what are we uh, researching here? Carbonate processors, so that's uh, for atmosphere, right? Uh, and then after that, we'll research the uh, Mohole mine. And then uh, then we'll be getting to the point where we can build Mohole. And basically, once we can build Mohole, uh, we don't have any particular uh, uh, problems. Because we won't run, at that point, we won't run out of uh, rare uh, metals. And we won't run out of uh, metals. But we do need boatloads of... Uh, machine parts to do that, and we're making boatloads of them now, so, uh, yeah, uh, that is, uh, actually, you know, like, we're basically to the point where there's not much more to do, and, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's basically, uh, yeah, there's not that many more episodes here, uh, before we can, uh, you know, declare things done. Now, there's one more random event that I expect will uh, pop up uh, at some point here. Uh, and that will be uh, uh, a new uh, colony appearing on Mars. Um, that uh, random event, I've got that every time I've tried uh, the uh, no uh, competitors uh, version. Um, and... Uh, uh, and on the 1075% uh, tries I've done off screen before I tried this one, uh, I actually got that, had that one fire every time. So that will uh, appear at some point. Anyway, let's uh, up the tempo on the on time here. And we'll just uh, take a boo at, uh, okay, so everything is going up. And the, um, somebody died. Why? They are a renegade. Yes. Okay. Fine. Renegades can die. That's that's our solution to renegades, right? Uh, and you may wonder uh, if if this really has done any good, uh, uh, sticking the renegades and idiots off over here on their own to die. Um, and uh, yeah, I, I'm not completely sure if it's made a huge difference, really. But it has, uh, it has um, made at least some level of difference uh, because we just don't have the uh, uh, sabotage in the other domes, right? Uh, and that, uh, that has kept our production online with less maintenance. So we're doing 379 power during the day, right? Uh, now, how do, I can't remember. Do we have the... Uh, no, it's under, under here. Uh, we have atomic accumulators. I'm thinking I might perhaps want to uh, build a couple of them. Uh, we have the polymers to do it, so I think that might not be a bad idea. So I'm going to put them... I'm going to put a couple of them up. See, they have a uh, limited output. Uh, they have a higher output than the batteries, but they have a much um, uh, slower uh, recharge time. So, uh, but they store boatloads more. And, uh, yeah, so here, we've got here, uh, charges at 50, uh, but it can output at 100, right? So, and we're storing 3,000 in it. So, uh, you know, I can put up several of those and demolish batteries, and uh, that will, uh, and that gets us a lot more power uh, stored um, and if we put enough of them up 
then, uh, well, we won't have, uh, oh, hey, I think we can stick them in here. Yeah, we can stick a couple of them in back of the uh, wind turbines. Oh, that's neat. So I'll put up a bunch of those. And then uh, they'll be able to store power. Oh, our uh, comm satellite thing is done. So we'll land that. We could build another one. But that's only going to give us... Um, uh, that's only going to give us 300 uh, uh, sponsor research um, if we did that, right? Uh, and it's a lot of uh, investment to do. But it's 400 sponsor research that we got from it, uh, in theory, anyway. Uh, and that means uh, we've got quite a bit of, uh, you, you know, we'll, uh, we'll make faster progress, right? Uh once these uh, uh, atomic accumulators are up, I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, demolish the uh, regular ones uh, over here. Uh, just because, uh, well, quite frankly, uh, they're going to require more maintenance. Is that, what's the maintenance on these two polymers? Uh, more maintenance for, you know, 300 storage right so uh, so if we uh, get rid of uh, these you know they've served us well uh, up to this point but let's be honest we don't need that many um, of them and let's uh, just not incur the uh, massive uh, uh, maintenance uh, cost of continuing to have them. Uh, and we have a great dust storm coming. Yeah. Uh, in three sols. So having fewer of these up uh, means we're going to suck up our polymers slower. Uh, which is kind of the uh, goal. Right, okay, so that's uh, that's the batteries cleaned up. Now, let's take a look. Power. We have stored power, 4,100. Uh, 4,400. Right? So, 4,800. So, we're uh, storing power at uh, 400 per tick here, right? Uh, per hour. And... Uh, Quite frankly, that's a pretty good rate, uh, especially since we burn uh, a lot less than that uh, at night, right? Now, uh, I'm going to also, no, go in uh, here under water and uh, chuck up a large water tank uh, or two. Uh, where can I chuck one up? Uh, can I... F oh, I can fit one in here. Yeah, I'll chuck one of those in there. Um, right. And we're gonna need pipe. Which will, uh, I suppose could come like this. Yeah, I'll do it like that. Um, right. Because uh, it just seems like a good idea to uh, have extra water storage. Um, yeah, it does seem like a good idea, doesn't it? Uh, so we've got a couple salts to fill that, and that will uh, definitely help. I'm not worried about the smaller water tanks because, well... They take metals, and we have lots of those. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I bet you we have six colonists that we do. Um, and we have... Uh, what do we have here? 
uh, we have six renegades. Yep. Uh, so yeah, keeping the renegades off on their own uh, definitely seems to be a thing to do. Now, uh, the uh, shuttles here will stop during the uh, dust storm. So uh, that will uh, definitely uh, uh, affect uh, our uh, production of things. Um, we, what we want is the carbonate processor, though. Because uh, I can put up a couple of those and then we can burn through the... Uh, uh, waste rock that we've accumulated and uh, and that and start getting uh, atmosphere up and as the atmosphere goes up the dust storms will reduce and when we hit 50% atmosphere I believe it is the dust storms end right so if we can get up there uh, we'll be laughing and the carbonate processors are about the best way to do that uh, meanwhile we're uh, we're slowly upping the temperature, and that's been helping with cold waves. Um, right, so, um, out of curiosity, how's this deposit doing? Okay, it's almost out, but with these concrete um, extractors and nano uh, refinement, uh, nano extractors, whatever it was, the that uh, allows us to extract from empty deposits, that um, should produce enough to uh, do our maintenance, at least until uh, uh, the uh, other, uh, you know, our concrete maintenance, uh, until some other uh, source of uh, concrete is going. Uh, also along with the waste rock processor, right? One building not working. Grocer. Not enough workers. Why is there not enough workers? Because we've got seniors. Right, okay. Well, uh, we'll uh, survive with that, I suppose. And you are... Uh, storage space is full. Um, where are we storing machine parts? Or machine parts. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's uh, grab a uh, depot for uh, machine parts and chuck one of those up. Yeah, that seems like the thing to do. Now, those should uh, get operational again. Uh, that's machine parts. There we go. Now. Okay, these guys are... Um, well, they're doing a thing. Uh, oh, we got carbonate processor. But what I'm going to do is... Uh, uh, let's... Oh, we're still constructing uh, drones. Um... What I'm going to do is uh, add more drones around here. Uh, that seems like a, a useful thing to do. Yeah, if we have more drones around there, that uh, definitely uh, isn't going to be a bad thing. Uh, I think I should wait until after the, uh, uh, oh, we got a meteor storm, the dust storm, before building the carbonate, uh, uh, processor. You are, uh, an export rocket. Uh, we do have, uh, we have some cure tatoes. Uh, we might as well just let the, uh, your Tato's uh, export thing happen, right? It's cash. And the dust storm is here. And... We're dropping eight water. And it's going to last only two sols. Two and a half sols. That's not bad. Um, okay. 
We got lots of drones whizzing around, so that will uh, help with uh, maintenance. Um, so we got uh, almost full power storage here. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's kind of good. We're dropping O2. Yeah, we should be okay. Uh, that's the thing. Uh, when we can open the domes, we don't need moxies anymore, uh, and that will uh, that will make uh, all the difference, right? Uh, so let's uh, take a look here. Um, no, it's over here. Carbonate processor. Uh, we can, uh, I don't know, stick one over here. Yeah, it's cold terrain, but it doesn't really matter, right? Um, we'll just drop drop one of those in there. It needs 200 concrete, which we have, 50 machine parts, which we have. So, um, right. So I think perhaps I should stick up another uh, machine parts uh, depot. Uh, machine parts. Yeah, we'll stick it there. Uh, okay, and then we'll uh, make that one uh, take full storage as well. Yeah. And uh, concrete. I think I should put up another concrete depot as well. Uh, concrete. Yeah, okay. Whoops. Uh, okay, so uh, the dust storm under two saws left, so we're doing okay there. Uh, right, so we got a huge uh, senior population uh, filtering through, and that's going to be a problem for a little bit. And that's the thing I was uh, kind of worried about, uh, which is why I wasn't ready to call it as a definite win yet, uh, because... Uh, if we if I tank the uh, birth rate too much, then we don't get uh, uh, then we end up with too many uh, uh, seniors and no workforce, right? And that uh, that is the uh, the big thing we want to avoid, right? Uh, but when these things go online, or at least I think we're, I'm going to want two or three of them, uh, then. Uh, the atmosphere will uh, start building and then we'll be good. Uh, right. We got a meteor storm. Where is it? Uh, over there. Yeah. Good. Uh, right. Yeah. Uh, so we in a in a bit over a sol, then both of our uh, disasters here will be finished, uh, and we're we're doing okay for storage here, and uh, these things get a boost during dust storms, right? Uh, um, yeah. So we have lots of uh, power, uh, and of course these guys need uh, maintenance, right? Oh well. Oh, we've got our uh, rovers here are uh, doing their thing. They're collecting metals and polymers, right? So we're up to hundred and over a hundred polymers. Uh, okay, so. We just need to get the Mohole mine up and then our rare metals. We found an anomaly. Um, wow. Well, that's um, different. Um, well, that's going to be a science boost uh, for Mohole. And, uh, you know, that'll be good. So that's where one of the things, you know, like if you uh, do a, uh, 
uh, if you call down meteor storms, uh, you can get uh, anomalies, right? And uh, and that uh, that can be beneficial, right? Uh, so how much science or, re or research are we going to get out of that, right? Uh, twelve fifty. Yeah, it could have been a lot less, uh, a lot less good. You know, you go back over here where you're protected. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, uh, what can we do here? You know, it seems so long since we were uh, building these ramps here <laughs> all around. Uh, it's just so, so long. Uh, you know, I, we spent so long uh, fiddling around getting the prep, prep work done. Uh, another anomaly. Oh. Uh, well, the meteor storm's just about done. By the time it gets there, uh, there shouldn't be any meteors going to hit it. Um, dust storm is, uh, done. Yep. Uh, oh, the Moxie, uh, um, the Moxie, I'm surprised this one hasn't, uh, fired already. Uh, we'll wait for repairs because we, uh, have lots of Moxies, right? Uh, now let's uh, let's go in orbital view here. Um, that's a SETI satellite. That's just cash. That's ice asteroids, which gives us uh, water, and that's regular meteors. Um, ice asteroids. We might as well do ice asteroid missions. We have the resources to do it, so so we'll do it. Uh, okay, we exported Cure Tatoes, 200 million. We got 1.1 billion in funding now. Now, it's always a good idea to have funding uh, set aside, uh, if you can. Uh, there are a couple random events where if you can drop a billion or so into it, uh, you can... Uh, uh, get some uh, better results. Uh, of course, if you don't have the funding, then, you know. And this is going to go online. Um, and, uh, yeah, these things are expensive to build. Um, okay, and now it's... Uh, it's putting uh, atmosphere up, right? Uh, so it's going to start um, uh, improving the atmosphere at a measurable rate. Uh, right. So far, so good. I probably want to uh, get a, another one of those going. Yeah, I, I've got the waste rock to do another one of those, so I'm going to go over here. Carbonate processor. I'm going to stick one over here. Uh, yeah, I'll stick it right there. Whoops. And we've got to get it power. Now we can get it power easy enough. We just uh, shove a cable, say, here. Yeah, that'll do it. We got 1,250 uh, uh, research for that anomaly as well. Um, now, where's the uh, explorer? The explorer can come back here uh, so that it's uh, protected, right? Uh, now, we, we could make new rovers if we uh, uh, want them. Uh, so that's not a big deal, but... It is, uh, you know, resources, right? Um, right, okay. So, uh, after the dust storm, we have 134 polymer, 225 machine parts, uh, lots of fuel. We have 75 uh, electronics. 
uh, and this uh, is going to uh, survive out until we get Mohole online, I think. Uh, building's not working. What's not working? Uh, grocer, research lab. Okay, yeah. Uh, and this is entirely due to our population aging out of the workforce, right? So, do I have... Uh, births are allowed. Births are allowed. Births are allowed. Okay. Um, yeah. So, uh, we definitely have... Uh, well, we have a good birth rate. Uh, we just had uh, a population uh, boom a while back, and uh, now we're going to see the uh, death wave from it. Um, but we still have we have 65 adults and 98 middle agers, so uh, the uh, the split there is actually a little bit better than it was, uh, and that uh, that will hopefully uh, you know improve things uh, over time. Uh, you know, what I'm going to do, though, is, uh, you know, the research lab can, you, the infirmary, I'm going to max out the infirmary, and the grocer, I'm going to max out the, uh, yeah, the research labs can suffer for, uh, uh, employees, but the uh, the other stuff really shouldn't. So, so yeah, definitely uh, do that. Uh, now, where are we? Uh, where where are we at here? Uh, we're coming up on half an hour. Okay, so this is uh, slowly uh, getting uh, created. Um, right. Well, I think what I'm going to do up there is uh, chuck a drone hub in here. Yeah, I'm going to chuck a drone hub in there as well. Uh, just to give it a little bit more um, service there, right? And since drone hubs, we just, just take some resources to build, but we've got autonomous drone hubs. Uh, we don't have to worry too much about where we stick them. Uh, this here, uh, yeah, it's just uh, collecting the concrete necessary, which we have, obviously. Uh, we're almost up to 1% atmosphere, uh, which is... Uh, that's going to slowly decrease the uh, solar uh, panel output, at which point we can demolish solar panels, right? Uh, matter of fact, we might be able to uh, real soon now anyway. Because we're uh, 288 positive power here uh, as we stand so uh, we could probably demolish some of them there's no particular need to at this point uh, how's yeah we've got lots of metals there so still so I'm gonna stick the mo hole in the middle of the uh, the uh, ice here uh, just because uh, you know just just so you know It'll take a while to build it, but, uh, yeah, it's, uh, not the worst, uh, thing I could do. Uh, actually, if I'm gonna do that, uh, what I should do in preparation is I'm gonna need a, uh, rare metals depot over here. And I'm gonna need a, uh, metals depot. Uh, metal. Yep, and I'm going to need, uh, I think I'm going to need a, uh, yeah, go back, uh, here, I'm going to stick also a universal depot here, but we're not going to store metals, or rare metals, or fuel, and we'll store about f six of each thing in there. We don't need food in there either. Um, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, we'll do that. And then uh, that should allow us to uh, get... 
to get everything we need for uh, doing the uh, mohole, uh, which is uh, we're 93% on the way there. Um, right. Uh, now, how's the uh, population doing? Uh, yeah, it's it should be uh, it should be doing okay-ish. You know, like you can see, we're up to 52 seniors there, 54 now, and that's uh, obviously going to be causing us a little bit of consternation, right? So, here we go. Um, Uh, Ninety-five percent on Mohol. Uh, what we can do here, actually, we can just do an outsource. That wasn't uh, what I wanted to do, actually. Uh, but if I'm going to screw that up, I'll just uh, just do that. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, I meant to outsource the full amount, right? So, uh, right. So I've got here uh, 97%. Uh, so that will be done real quick now. Let's just uh, check in over here. Uh, yeah, Mohole. Um, you know, what, uh, what can we do here? Uh, terraforming. Uh, that one could be good. Uh, uh, right, we could get a core heat convector. Um, let's, uh, grab that one, uh, in the queue. Uh, trees, right? Uh, is, I, I think possibly by the time we uh, finish, we might be planting trees or something. Uh, you know, and that would be good. Uh, right. So, uh, where are we at here? Mohol's just about done. And then I'll actually, uh, we'll actually get, yep, there we go. We've completed the research for Mohol. Now let's, uh, let's go in, uh, go in here. And we'll go in, uh, Wonders. Uh, we could build the Omega Telescope as well, but that we don't have the resources for yet. 300 uh, machine parts. Uh, yeah, let's um, let's uh, drop it down here. Yep. Bang. Uh, and that's going to suck up our uh, resources for quite a while while it builds but we do have the resources to build it or we will have by the time everything uh, uh, finishes here so yeah it's uh, it's ticking along when this comes online it's going to suck up a fair bit of power but it's also going to provide us basically unlimited rare metals and metals, right? And that uh, that's going to be uh, that's going to be important, uh, which is why uh, which is why I'm uh, I'm doing it, right? Anyway, uh, now where uh, where do we stand here on? Uh, we have done. A Marsquake, four buildings damaged. Uh, new special project, capture ice asteroids. We completed capture ice asteroids. Um, what do you, you need? Uh, you have been repaired. Okay. Um, so we could send up another ice asteroids mission, uh, which, you know what? I'm going to do that. Send expedition. Uh, having uh, the more water on the uh, planet is uh, useful. Whoops. You can uh, land. Right. And then... Uh, how are you doing? Uh, you got all the metal you need. Uh, you're working your way through the uh, machine parts 
and the uh, concrete. So that will uh, come online ultimately uh, when it's ready. I'm definitely going to want to uh, uh, chuck up a uh, laser probably over here. Yeah. And I'm going to need to chuck up a uh, power cable. Uh, or did I... Oh, I got it right adjacent. Okay, I don't... Um, okay, so where, where do we, uh, uh, where are we, okay, yeah, we're going to have low storage on this, uh, we're, uh, several short on, uh, on uh, machine parts. Uh, uh, you know, like once the concrete's uh, uh, delivered here, I might just pause Mohole for a, a little bit here. Uh, we need 33 more, so that's another Saul's worth of production, right? And uh, that's going to take a uh, moment or two to uh, filter through. Okay, so we got that. We need 30 of those. Um, yeah, let's pause that and we'll let the uh, machine parts uh, uh, build up again. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'm going to get the mohole built. Uh, that's, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get the mohole built. Uh, once I do... Uh, yeah, we're up to 10, just about. Yeah, we're producing 32 per uh, sol, so. Um, okay, what's not working? That's a research lab. A laser has no power. Um, two research labs and a laser. Yeah, the laser will come online. How's this doing? Uh, well... Uh, it could be doing better. You know, it could be doing better. Uh, but uh, the number of seniors is obviously the uh, major issue there. Anyway, once we have Mohole online, uh, as long as we don't run out of colonists, uh, we should be able to uh, uh, recover. Uh, because the uh, critical uh, materials, we have the production capacity with no uh, colonists to uh, get metals, uh, rare metals, and so on. Uh, we'll just need, uh, uh, and uh, uh, we'll be able to uh, probably get keep enough uh, machine parts. Because I think that's what Mohol needs to for maintenance to uh, keep everything running. Uh, that's up to 24 now. Uh, 25. Yeah, so it's going up. Once that gets up to 30, a uh, little past 30, I'll uh, unpause the moho mine here and uh, then we'll see what happens. Uh, so it's up to 30 now, 31, uh, dropped to 30 again, so that's obviously some maintenance. Uh, yeah, so we'll start that up again, uh, and then we'll, uh, we'll see how fast it, uh, it goes here. Uh, right. So... Yeah, Mohol has, uh, I think, two or three upgrade levels as well, so you can get quite a lot of resources out of it. Uh, okay, so 293. Yeah, we, we're just, just about there for the drones to actually start building it. 
And uh, while I'm in here, available prefabs, let's up the drones available in that hub. Uh, now, it's building it now. Okay. Now, the machine parts will uh, restock now. And, uh, yeah. It's just about up. Now watch, it'll get hit by a meteor immediately. I've had that happen. Uh, it's really annoying. Uh, Mohole is online. Yay. Uh, okay. Uh, so. Uh, yeah. So this takes um, a bit of power. Uh, and maintenance is machine parts. Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to be producing stacks of waste rock out of this and, uh, uh, you know, metal and, uh, and so on, right? Uh, so here we go. We got Mohole. It's uh, gone online. And uh, I'm going to build... Uh, another couple of these. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to build five of them. Water chip. Okay, the Moxie. Uh, okay, so... Um, uh, uh, let's see. Uh, okay. It will take six sols. Yeah, we'll do that one. Uh, we actually have the water reserves that we can do that. So, yeah, let's do that. Right. So Mohole here is uh, doing its thing. Uh, yeah, so there's three upgrades. 200 machine parts, 400, and 800. So 1,400 machine parts more to maximize it all the way up. So Mohole's expensive, but uh, yeah, it, uh, it works uh, pretty well. Uh, okay, our turbines have come online. Good. Uh, we'll upgrade them all to polymer blades. There we go. And we're getting a boost from atmosphere on those. We're up to 4.6% atmosphere, so 4.7 now. Uh, why is it... Uh, oh, we got a cold wave. I see. Uh, okay. Uh, well... Let's, uh, cold wave. How long is the cold wave? Uh, long enough. Okay. Well, let's, uh, uh, well, we'll stick up one, two, three, four, five more of those. Uh, yeah. Yeah, put up the wind turbines here and, uh, You know, hopefully that uh, uh, gets things uh, operational again. Uh, you know, keeps the uh, power from uh, from being too uh, uh, overdrawn. Yeah, that's uh, that's an important thing to do here. Uh, make sure we don't run out of power. We have the industrial capacity to maintain these things, so uh, might as well get them online. Yeah, there we go. And polymerize them. Uh, and then that gets us up to uh, a much better uh, power level. Uh, obviously, the mohole can't thaw this during a cold wave. Because it's operating, but it's not showing thawed here. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, there we go. 
So we've got the uh, the cold wave underway, of course. Uh, now, if I I kind of probably should uh, well, let's uh, go in here. Um, yeah, we'll grab the core heat convector uh, research as well. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's uh, basically uh, going to be it for for this episode. We have Mohol online. And uh, we can probably, uh, once our resources build up some more, we'll build up another uh, uh, couple of these things. And uh, uh, we're pretty much laughing. Uh, just one more check in here. Um, yeah, uh, we kind of need more... Um, uh, people so that should be uh, fun anyway uh, that's uh, that's gonna be all for uh, for this episode so uh, you know there's still a, probably three or four more episodes uh, I think uh, before we can open the domes probably more uh, I'm not sure uh, but there's a bit of work to do yet and we have to potentially deal with a population collapse so uh, there there we go uh, that's uh, that's all for this time, so uh, stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much, and uh, see you back next time.